On this Wash Hog Wednesday, I'm gonna tell you why you need to be careful about using poor grade soaps that may be intended for a power washer, but they're really not. Okay, so we, I talked about this a couple weeks ago. This customer uh, brought in their machine here for repair, running low pressure. They were, they're using a low grade soap. And what happens when you use a low grade soap is that it deposits inside the coil, inside the pump, inside the pressure hose. And when you add heat to the equation, it creates more deposits and it begins to stop up the line. So I'm gonna show you on the outside of the coil here, I've already broken this line loose. I'm gonna show you how bad the restriction is. So take a look at this. That is normally, that's a half inch fitting that has about a, that has a 3 8 hose on it. So it's got a good, <laughs> it should have at least four to five times that much flow going through it as it does right now. This is all encased with deposits that have come from running a cheap soap that we would not recommend you use in your machine. You wanna watch out for that. You wanna buy, it, whether it be ours or somebody else's, buy from a reputable source that sells soaps that are intended for use in a power wash equipment. All of our soaps that we sell here at powerwash.com, especially with the deluxe brand, are intended for use in a power washer. You will not get this kind of build up. Um, and if you're not buying from us or you're using from another distributor, make sure that you get the right soaps that are intended to be used in your equipment so that you don't have a similar issue like this. Um, it, there's, and to give you an idea of the pressure drop because of that restriction, at the unloader, this machine is running around 3,000 PSI. Even, even the unloader's not working right because it's getting some stuff in it. So at the pump, 3,000 PSI, you get to the end of the gun and it's only running 700 PSI because there's so much restriction in that line now. So the, the, the unloader is actually bypassing a lot of excess water because it can't pump it through the coils and through the hose to get to the trigger gun where the guy needs to be able to do the work. Getting a really good soap is super important. So I'll have more tips for you next week. Stay tuned. This is that week's, this week's Wash Hawk Wednesday. I'm Mike Kinderlite, Dana Power Wash. See you next time.